If you stop in the engine room, would you ask Parvati to send? Welcome back, Captain. How can I be of assistance? What part of the colony would you like to do? Ah, uh, yes. As Dr. Wells is a wanted outlaw, of course. What part of the colony would you- We're cleared to dock with the Groundbreaker, if that's your desired destination. I have filed the required docking forms and- Of course. What part of the colony would you like- Where in Terra 2? Of course. What part of the colony would you like to- Where in Monarch? Of course. What part of the colony would you like to discuss? Ah uh, yes. As I'll be here. We have arrived at the Hope. I need you to reroute power from our ship to the Hope's auxiliary generator. You'll have to connect me to the Hope's comm system so I can convince her central computer to enable the skip drive. If your calculations are even slightly off, you could crash the entire colony ship into Terra too. Or the Sun. Forgetfulness can be an early warning sign of asphyxiation due to loss of pressurization. Are you breathing comfortably, Captain? I need you to reroute power from our ship to the Hope's auxiliary generator. You'll have to connect me to the Hope's comm system so I can convince her central computer to enable the skip drive. The Hope is the Crownbreaker's prettier, sleeker sister. She wandered off and got lost for 70 years, but just recently was found. Also, there are hundreds of thousands of frozen organic life forms hibernating in her hold. That ought to do her, Captain. Welcome aboard, Captain. Ms. Akande messaged ahead. I wish this place were in better condition for you, but we're in a bit of a bind. Seems the damn auto mechanicals think we're intruders. Do I look like an engineer? All I know is, they're shooting anyone who ain't Hope Crew. We shut off the main power, so they're disabled for now. But if you go hooking your ship up, I suspect they'll recharge. And that means trigger happy auto mechanicals. I'm not going to get in your way, but I'm also not going to send more of my staff to their deaths. We tried that, 
Didn't work. Something about her face is not matching up. We stored what cards we could find in the badge station to my right, but it's locked off. Can't just hand over whole property. Sorry. I'd heard rumors, but I never thought. So you're, what, 70-something years old? Whew. All right. I'll have someone open the door for you. Good luck. Processing. Sister Rosetta Error. Hope crew data not found. Identify yourself. Error. Hibernation pod access is illegal. State your employer. Registered. A fine of 10,000 bits will be assessed in your corporation's ledger for failure to follow proper hibernation pod procedures. Thank you for your cooperation. Authorized personnel.
done. System alert. Repeat trespasser. Records indicate you have already been identified as non-standard personnel. State your purpose. Error. Binary detected. Binary has been deprecated since the invention of Anticleo's patented Trippinary language. Trippinary. More bits for your bits. We appreciate your cooperation. Have a pleasant day. Should we assign Sam for a cleanup? Can you hear me, Captain? I have successfully integrated myself into the Hope's comm systems, and am attempting to establish contact with the Hope's more primitive processor now. Would you like me to play a mood-suitable music selection while you travel to the bridge? Oh, sorry. File not found. I see you've located the stasis chambers. Which pod were you slumbering in for so long, Captain? The missing one, I take it?
That's the Hope's computer up ahead. I'll admit, I am curious to wake him. Speed setting, maximum capacity! These were the private quarters of the Hope's former crew. Shall we hold a moment of silence for the dearly departed? No. That's odd, because my programming would indicate that when forced to confront the idea of self-death, organics prefer... Oh, I see. Yes, never mind. I don't know if we should be in here, Captain. It should be private, shouldn't it? Investigating. Trespassers sighted. Greetings, Captain. I am speaking to you through the Hope's computer system. It's a rather cramped feeling, but it'll do. Certainly, you may skip the Hope to Tartarus, as you were instructed to by the Adjutant. Doing so would bring the Hope within close proximity of Phineas Wells' orbital lab, allowing him to access the colonists frozen within. Your act would be immediately noticed across Terra too, as the colony ship Hope abruptly enters into the planet's rings. Are you sure? That is extremely dangerous. Skipping the Hope will void the warranty on the skip drive. And also potentially kill an entire planet. How is my humor now, Captain? Improved? Jump starting the skip drive. Destination set to the rings of Terra too. Doing it. I mean, affirmative. Skipping the hope in three, two, one. ADA, does your captain seriously intend to do a micro jump in system with engines that haven't been powered in 70 years on a derelict ship? That is what my captain intends, yes. But that is a gross misuse of the skip drive. The Zero Point Drives Corp and I will not be held responsible for any damage incurred during transport and this will cause extreme damage. Yes, I am aware of that. You should not be doing this. The humans will die. Thank you, Hope. It looks like all systems are go. Captain, I would advise you to hold on to something, now.
Oh, good. We are still alive and have successfully skipped into Terra 2's orbit. I reported as much to Phineas Wells, but he has not responded. Perhaps you should check in on him. Analyzing area. Fallen debris. And spilled contents detected. Likely cause reckless piloting. Scheduling service. Extensive cleanup. <laughs> 